Hi, Stan Stans. My name is Stan. Welcome to the world of extra. So, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys know that I have a boyfriend. <laughs> and it's crazy that I'm making this video because he's literally on FaceTime, but I muted my mic so he can't hear me. He's staying with his family in the US for a little bit. And the plan is he's gonna come back to Tokyo, not for another month. And the worst thing is, it's his birthday next week, and he thinks he's not gonna see me. And they've just been so sad that we're apart for a little bit. I bought a plane ticket to the US a month ago, and he doesn't know about it. And I'm gonna surprise him for his birthday, you guys. I've been talking to his family making plans on how to surprise him. He thinks he's not gonna see me and I'm not gonna see him for his birthday. But we have been cooking up a big surprise. I'm so excited and I'm so nervous. I hope this goes according to plan. Especially because we have each other's location shared on our phone. So I'm gonna have to like sneakily turn off find my iPhone. Let's see how everything goes. The last time he was here in August, we got two disposable film cameras that we used the entire summer we were together. For his birthday, I'm going to develop the pictures and I'm going to make an entire album for him. Excuse me? Okay. We're at Tokyo Hands right now. We're choosing some albums. I think I'm just gonna get him this simple blue one because blue is his favorite color. I also got a bunch of stickers of his favorite things. Dogs, Sanrio, Mamechi, Pokemon of course, and dogs again. I just love making albums, you guys. It's like preserving the memories in physical form. I feel like we all just think about like Instagram and like soft copies of photos. But I think there's this beauty in like preserving memories with like physical copies and albums. And I want to do that with my boyfriend for like the rest of our lives making memories and like doing everything together and then taking pictures and like documenting them. it's more sentimental wait just kidding abort mission we're not doing this blue one we're doing this light blue one with this case and you can actually refill it yourself so i'm gonna get yellow pink and blue and you can write on it and everything and i think we should get more of these and i like, keep adding i think that's like such a sentimental thing that's so cute ah! I also got the photos. Let's do some scrapbooking. Also, just a little side quest. Because it's my mom's birthday today, we got my mom a birthday gift. It's one of her favorite bags. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> でかいプレゼント初めて見た。大体ここ見ただけでちょっと驚いたんだけど。くだかな。お家かな何入ってるんだろう。心配しないでママのリンスもさ、絶対。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ
That took a lot of fucking time. <laughs> Not anything for my husband. Oh! This is how it looks like the first page. So I'm just gonna put it like that. Close that pussy. Something like that. Two hours later. <sighs> I got it. <laughs> I'm done. It literally took me an hour and a half. I think literally two hours. But I'm finally finished. I wrote him a long letter on the album. Just a bunch of post-it notes. And I just, you know, told him everything I wanted to tell him for his birthday. I love this page. I added a lot of stickers and stuff, of course. You guys see that? <laughs> <laughs> the end. Wow. I wrapped it. I put a ribbon and everything. His favorite color is blue, so this is my gift to him. Um, I haven't finished packing and I have to leave in 20 minutes. He's on FaceTime right now. I just muted the mic. See you in a little, little bit. bit. Ah! Anyway, I'm gonna catch a cab to New York. I'm so nervous. I just got back from Cebu yesterday. I can't believe I'm getting on another flight tonight. Okay, so the most nerve-wracking part that I've been thinking of and I've been researching about is how to stop sharing my location because we have our location shared just for like, you know, boyfriend's purposes. Like, we're not like toxic, like checking each other's locations all the time or whatever. But just for like safety and stuff, like if you have each other's locations. I know you guys do it with your best friends. I know you guys do it with your boyfriend. Shut the fuck up. It's not toxic. <laughs> Anyway, I had to find a way to like stop sharing location without him getting any notification. So I found a way and I'm gonna do it now. Location, location is officially, is officially not, not shared. Not <laughs> we gotta get to New York quick before he notices. But like I have a lot of different excuses if he asks. It's fine. White lies for a surprise. It's fine. It's not real lying. Shut up. Okay, we're in the cab, you guys. We're on our way to the airport. Stewie's coming with me. He's helping me with my suitcase and everything. I hope it's not overweight because I actually brought so much shit. Thank God it's not like a connecting flight or anything. It's a direct flight to New York. It's gonna be about 13 to 14 hours, which I'm so nervous about because I really don't like long haul flights, but I'm gonna do my best. We made it to Canada Airport. I'm I'm so exhausted. I've actually been getting like three to four hours of sleep every night. So I think I'll fit right in with the New York time zone. I bought some melatonin. I'm gonna try to sleep as much as possible on the flight. I'm so tired. I can't wait. I got myself a neck pillow for the first time. I actually never use neck pillows, but I thought it was like a good addition to this little spontaneous trip. Jimmy, thank you for helping me. I'm gonna go. I love you. Thank you. I'll be in New York for literally like 10 days. I hope everything goes well. Thank you. Wish me luck. <laughs> Thank you. I'm gonna go. I also did some last minute shopping. You guys, I literally forgot to eat lunch as I was getting ready today and like preparing my gifts and everything and my surprise. So I decided to get myself like two bullshit airport sandwiches to eat. I'm so hungry. I forgot to eat lunch. It's literally almost six. <laughs> Okay, there's no dilly dally because the reservation for the restaurant is at 9 p.m. and it's currently 8.50. So I literally just have to like quickly redo my makeup and then go to the restaurant right away. The dinner is at Italy. My boyfriend is currently on the way there. I think his family's already waiting. His sister Valm helped me get these flowers. She literally delivered it to my hotel. Thank you so much, Valm. So I can't forget these and the gift I made. What does it look like I'm asking him to prom? Will he go to prom with me? Okay, fuck, I have to do my makeup. I wanted to shower first, but I literally have no time. I mean, I can't believe I'm even doing my skincare routine. Stop distracting me! Oh my god, I'm so stressed out. This is my outfit. Okay, with glasses or no glasses? My boyfriend loves it when I wear these glasses, so maybe I should. But I kind of feel like no glasses is better with this look. It's just like such bad boy vibes. <laughs> but like the glasses makes it look kind of soft, you know? Don't I just look like such a boyfriend? Anyway, let me go. You guys, I'm hiding in the corner. I'm so nervous. <laughs> I'm so nervous. They're like inside the restaurant and I'm outside. Okay, lah. Kung wala na unsang contact. Obvious na contact ko. Di
Thank you. <laughs> 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 <laughs>